In this video, we will discuss about Baheda. Baheda is also called as Bhibitaki. Uh, this Bhibitaki is used in Sanskrit language. Uh, it means that one that keeps away from diseases. So this is also called as Baheda. Bahera. Uh, different names are there. Bhibitaki. And its botanical name is Terminalia Balerica. This belongs to family Combritaceae, and this plant is in the form of a tree, right? We can see here. This is this is the tree of Bahera. This is about twelve to fifty meters tall. These are its leaves. So Bahera plant is in the form of tree, and it is deciduous tree. Uh, leaves may fall in the autumn season. Height may be from twelve to fifty meters, and leaves they are alternately arranged. We can see here. These are the leaves. Leaves are obovate in shape. They are leathery and their margin is entire, and they have a this pointed apex, right? So leaves they are obovate, leathery, entire. A leaf tip is narrow, pointed, and this is deciduous tree, right? Then a, a, this also bears flowers in the May. Flowers are greenish yellowish with an offensive odor, and they are. In clusters in the form of axillary spikes, uh, then these flowers uh, they ripen to form fruits. Fruits are ovoid in shape, grey in color, and their kernels they are sweet but narcotic in nature. Now, if we see its phytochemical constituents, this is rich in vitamin C, proteins, minerals uh, like potassium, selenium, manganese, iron, and copper. This also has different kind of acids, tannic acid. Allergic acid, chabulagic acid, gallic acid, oxalic acid, uh, philambolin, beta cytosterol, mannitol, glucose, fructose, raminose, etc. Now, can, economically important part is fruit, and fruit is in the droop category, and this is ovoid in shape. Now, this is when fruit matures up. This is the fruit of uh, Baheda. And all the parts of the uh, Bahera tree, they are beneficial, but mainly we use its Bahera fruits or Bahera seeds. So what are its benefits or what is its economic importance? Uh, Bahera can be powdered and this can be made in the form of churin and or its decoction can be prepared. This is used for various purposes. So uh, it is beneficial for digestion. This improves the digestion because this helps in uh, production of more of the digestive juices, helps in breakdown of the food, as well as this control the uh, bloating and gaseous cramps or gas formation in the stomach. Uh, this also helps in relieving the constipation because this helps in easy movement of the stool from the intestine. This secretes the formation of bile by the liver. So this act as laxative. So motion is easily passed through the intestine and constipation is relieved. Now because it is rich in antioxidants, so this boosts the immunity in the body. This improves immune system by fighting with various kind of microorganisms or microbes. And this protects the body from various kind of infections. Uh, because this has antibacterial, antiviral and antifungal properties. So bacterial, viral and fungal infections here controlled in the body so this will improve the overall health as well as wellness of the body and this makes the immune system stronger this is also good for heart functioning so this improves the cardiac functioning uh, fruit powder have strong ex uh, expectorant properties as well as purgative properties uh, laxative properties it helps in strengthening the heart muscles uh, helps in pumping more of the blood lowering cholesterol level in the blood and also uh, prevents the formation of uh, accumulation of the lipid in the blood or in the arteries, which in turn reduce the risk of atherosclerosis. Just arteries may plague jam jata hai, ya lipid jam jata hai, to se uska lumen narrow ho jata hai, and that leads to heart attacks. Agar atherosclerosis nahi hoga, to heart attacks bhi control ho jayenge, as well as blood clotting is controlled. This also helps in treating wounds and ulcers. Uh, like it has anti-inflammatory, inflammation ko control karta hai. This has anti-ulcer properties, ulcer formation nahi hone deta. So Bahera treats different types of ulcers also. Uh, this Because this is controlling inflammation in the body. So, so this helps in controlling arthritis and rheumatism. What is rheumatism? Uh, joints ki swelling ko hum rheumatism bolte hai. Joints 
में हमें जैसे वो सख्त सा कुछ जम जाता है उसको हम आर्थराइटिस बोलते हैं जिससे हमारे जॉइंट मूव नहीं होते हैं जॉइंट्स में पेन होता है जॉइंट में स्वेलिंग हो जाती है सो आर्थराइटिस एंड रिमिटिज्म दे आर कंट्रोल्ड दिस ऑल्सो कंट्रोल्स अ ब्लड शुगर लेवल सो दिस रेगुलेट डायबिटिक इन द बॉडी आई मीन दिस कंट्रोल द ब्लड शुगर लेवल सो दिस इज एंटी डायबिटिक इन नेचर दिस इम्प्रूव कॉगनेटिव फंक्शनिंग दिस इज गुड फॉर योर ब्रेन दिस इम्प्रूव द फंक्शनिंग ऑफ द ब्रेन इम्प्रूव द फोकसिंग इम्प्रूव द मेमरी रीजनिंग प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग एंड अदर कॉगनेटिव एबिलिटीज इन द बॉडी दिस ऑल्सो हेल्प्स इन कंट्रोलिंग वेरियस काइंड ऑफ रेस्पिरेटरी इन्फेक्शन लाइक इफ कोल्ड इज देयर सोर थ्रोट इज देयर कफ इज देयर फ्लू इज देयर सो दीज आर कंट्रोल विद द हेल्प ऑफ बहेरा This helps in removal of phallum in the chest as well as in the nasal passage. जैसे जम जाता है हमारे nose में जम जाता है या हमारे chest में जम जाता है तो उससे हमें bronchitis भी हो जाता है And this also controls asthmatic conditions in the body. So ये जो सारा बहेरा है हमारे respiration की जो जितनी भी problems हैं उनको control करने में help करता है This also uh, helps in reducing the fever in the body because it has anti-parasitic uh, and anti-pyretic properties. Anti-anti-parasitic is this can fight with bacteria, virus, and fungus. So, so this will control a uh, different kind of infection. So, जो microorganism toxin produce करते हैं उनको भी reduce करने में help करता है और उससे fever control हो जाता है. So this has anti-pyretic properties. Uh, body temperature को reduce करने में help करता है. As well as जितनी भी infection है उनके साथ ये fight करता है. तो जो fever का tendency है या intensity है that can be reduced with the help of bahera. Bahera is good for oral health. Uh, this helps in controlling bad breath from your oral cavity. अगर gums फूले हुए हैं या उनमें pain है तो उनको भी ये reduce करता है Because this has germ killing properties, तो ये हमारी oral cavity को clean रखता है Bahera is good for skin. This has anti aging properties. Uh, this will uh, control the wrinkles on the skin as well as various kind of pigment formation on the skin. Uh, this control the formation of acne and mm -hmm. acne scars. This has antibacterial properties. This helps in exfoliating pro uh, skin. Uh, exfoliating properties mean this helps in removal from the uh, removal from the skin of the dead skin, right? So dead skin upper se nikal jati hai, to usse hamari jo skin hai wo radiant ho jayegi. Pigments are also controlled. Behera also helps in controlling various kind of hair problems because this is uh, has antibacterial, anti uh, antiviral, anti fungal properties, anti inflammatory properties. So, jitni bhi scalp ki infection hai, like uh, folliculitis, dandruff, ya fungal ko infection hai ya itching hai, so that can be controlled with the help of Behera. Uh, this also nourishes the uh, uh, basis of the hair follicles with essential nutrients. so this will improves the blood circulation and if a uh, base becomes strong so this will strengthen the root hairs and this will also reduce the uh, falling of the hair so this controls the hair fall pro problem also uh, from the skin then uh, bahera is an important constituent of trifla formulation amla harad and bahera they are used in the ayurvedic preparation of trifla Trifla has many medicinal properties. This is used in the Ayurvedic medicines. So important constituents of uh, trifla are bahera, harar, and amla. Uh, amla we have discussed in one video. Bahera we are discussing now. Harar we discuss in the next video. Now this trifla has gastrointestinal benefits. Uh, this uh, reduces the toxins in the body. So this causes detoxification because this uh, removes the toxin. So this cleanses the system. This is having antibacterial, antifungal, anti-inflammatory properties. So this control various kind of infection. This also control the sugar level. So this is anti-diabetic, and this also reduces the cholesterol. And trifla also acts as laxative. This improves the digestion process. Uh, so uh, this is about uh, bahera. And if you have any question, you can ask me in the comment box. And if you like my video, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching my video.